Boccalacci and then Louis Pret within Q3. And 163 Lamborghini there. This is the car that had pole position earlier on. He's back right out of it. Yeah, he's just looking for a bit of clear air. And as he backs up, then he gets a line of cars to be behind him. So whether he now gets back on the throttle and tries to... He doesn't want to let more cars pass because that's only going to further inhibit his progress. Uh, yeah, Christian Engelhardt, I should have said, was in 163. Mirko Bortolotti, we've established, is the fastest driver and he could go quicker again. Look, two personal bests. Jules Gounon is up to third in Q2 and third on average, and that was with an absolute best in the last sector. So number two, Mercedes, is back at the races. Engelhardt's now done an absolute best in sector one. And what can Bortolotti do? It was a 52.948. He breaks the beam at a 52.7 to go even quicker. Very impressive indeed from Mirko Bortolotti. That is a good time on 52.775 and consolidates the performance that he saw or gave just a few minutes ago. As Jules Gounod 